music. It is moral law. It gives a soul to the universe, wings to the mind, flight to the imagination, and life to everything. Music is basically my life. When I listen to a song, I get goosebumps. I feel, I feel a little like butterflies inside of me almost. Even though the passion of these young students is evident, they still have had a rough time convincing family and friends that for them, music is more than a hobby. One corporation that has taken notice is the Belize Bank. Being the, the largest and perhaps the most prominent bank in Belize, we feel that we have a sense of obligation to give back to the communities we serve. And we do not serve any one particular community, we serve the entire community of Belize. So that as a result of that, we have different activities which service the needs of you know, indigent individuals. We have programs that service the needs of kids who are involved in sporting activities, cultural activities. We obviously have an educational program that we're involved in. And of course, the cultural initiative which we established last year with the um, Philharmonic Youth Orchestra of Trinidad and Tobago. It was through this collaboration between the Belize Bank and Niche that a few young persons from the National Youth Orchestra of Belize were given the opportunity of a lifetime to play with the Trinidad and Tobago Youth Philharmonic in the Twin Isle Republic. The news about going to Trinidad to play with the Trinidad and Tobago Youth Philharmonic, it was incredible. Mr. Young called me and he said, Chelsea, um, we selected you to go to Trinidad to play with the, to play TTYP. Um, do you accept? And I'm like, yes, Mr. Young, of course, I'm going, I'm gonna go. <laughs> the main criteria was they had to show an interest in their instrument and they were thinking career in the instrument. That was the main criteria. This opportunity gave them a unique experience to see the level of discipline and dedication young musicians from other countries put into their respective art forms. They were musicians young as me and younger than me playing at such a high level. If I didn't practice, it showed and everybody would know Wow, she does not practice. Like she, she needs to like buckle down. You know, I what I didn't want to be seen as that person, especially since I was from Belize and I went. I'm going to another country. I didn't want to bring the orchestra down. I mean, they're already good, so I have to be up there too. Even though the instructor in the Venezuela are there to help you, they will not help you learn your music. You have to do that yourself. I will, all what they will do is just guide you to important parts in the music. Having expanded their knowledge base and their general understanding of music, it is the shared hope of the Belize Bank and Niche that these young persons will pass on the knowledge they have acquired so that other young musicians can benefit from it. Well, the idea is each one teach one. So you have gotten this opportunity, you've gotten back home. It's now up to you to share that experience with your brother or your sister or a fellow member of your orchestra so that they would benefit, if not um, directly, tangentially from the experience that they had. We are committed to this initiative. My goal is that in five to seven years, Belize will have a youth orchestra consisting of about 100 players that can tour the Caribbean, that can tour Central America, and at the end of the day, these kids will be very productive citizens and hopefully will be future leaders in Belize. That's really the objective, to build a better society. With the newfound dedication of these young players, backed by the support of Niche and the assistance of the Belize Bank, there is no doubt that music will continue to blossom in our land by the sea. <laughs>